Hey, Kevin Corn Cousins. This is Mitch, your welder fabricator at Cycles and More Fabrication. You guys know me as KettleCornSupplies.com, and that's because I do a lot of poppers. That's what I pretty much do all day long now. And I wanted to show you this. A local guy bought this. It's got my 36 inch bowl. This is the 36 inch Supreme model. I might sell one of these a year, not too many. But these bowls alone take me eight weeks to get from the time I order them. So I don't keep them in stock and the bowls alone are almost $2,000. So these aren't something I build a lot of, but if you want one, give me a call. Not something I wanna do a lot of though, just warning you. It takes about three to four months if you want one from the time you order it to actually get it done. And if I spent nothing but the time working on this, I would probably have 10 customers calling me every day, you know, mad at me. So I have to give, kind of use this in between or build it in between. But I want to show it to you because it just turned out so nice. I really like how it turned out. The local guy, uh, our kettle corn cousin, uh, from Kellogg, actually, is going to be using it. This is one of my pride and joys. You ready? Watch this. I'm really quite strong. No, I'm not. This 150 hello, 200 pound bowl is made easy to lift because of my pulley system in here, which is top secret, so you can't tell anybody about it. My competitors will want to copy it. Oh, they'll figure it out anyway if they got half a brain, which most of them, some do. Anyway, so this is my pulley system. It's got eight pulleys on it. It takes what? Feels like a 150 pound, 200 pound bowl and lid system. It's really light. It's actually harder to push down than it is to lift up. But I'm going to do it one more time just because I like to do it. Ready? Watch. Woo! It's so beautiful. I like it. Now, I'm going to show you the burner system. So come on in here and I'll show it to you. Come on, cousins. Come on in and look at this. This is my lighter system. No gas pilot lights for your fire guys to worry about. Now you'll light this side over here and then when that side's lit you light this side because of course you got a flame there so it's going to light. And then once you get this thing going, so you got a lot of oil and popcorn in this. Uh, once it's heated up and it starts to pop you want to be able to turn it down so you don't burn it just like anything else. Whether you're cooking eggs or meat or anything you want to have it raised up for a while and then lower the temperature to let it cook slowly. Um, anyway, a little critter, so, or a piece of metal. So, this thing could probably do about, oh, I'd say about $100 per batch, maybe 150 to 200 So, you could do four batches in an hour. You could probably make about four to $600 an hour on this thing, just continuous poppers. And you do it all yourself. I can build an auto steer for it. That'll take a while, but it, it is possible. It's always better to pop by hand when you can anyway. So here we go. I'm gonna put it down. I don't want to spend a whole lot of time on this, but just like all my other poppers, oh, I'll show you to you. You'll notice that this is the popper side, so it, there's no vents on this side, unless you take the metal off and you put it over there. So if you want, you can pop from that side. All you gotta do is take that vent off and move this over there so you can pop. So, and I can customize this a little bit. I had one customer have a handle here and a handle there so two people could lift it. Um, it just made it easier because when you're doing huge batches like this, two people are gonna be running it anyway. Anyway, so this is it. Oh, and it's got fully locking casters all the way around. And uh, you can see, pretty much the same design basic as all my 140s and my Deluxe Pro. This is just the big, big, big brother. Anyway, Kale Corn Cousin, I just wanted to show you a little bit, give you a little taste of what this big monster looks like. Thanks for watching my video, and be mighty. Have a great season this year. Bye-bye.